Hello, my name is Solo Artist 0425. Just want to thank you so much for clicking this video. Um, basically, this is a double Moab video that me and my friends managed to record on Sabotage the other night. Basically, we're playing Sabotage on the map Village, and it is possibly one of my favorite Sabotage maps because you can easily hold the bomb on the left side of the map over here by the bridge in between um, C and B Dom. The Dom flags and uh, you can there's only three entrances the back the front and under the bridge and you can easily hold it down if you have three or more teammates so what's going on here is I'm watching the front my friend Jesse is watching the back and razzle dazzle is running around covering the middle you can see here I get my Moab it's actually my very first Moab and I'm, you can see very excited and I <laughs> kind of decided to go Rambo for a bit and the sucky thing is, I actually only pick up a double kill from this Moab because Raz decided to go around and kill everybody as the Moab was coming in, so I managed to get the double kill. So I was very happy in getting my very first Moab, I've gotten so unlucky um, before. And here you can see is from uh, Jesse's perspective, that kid is unreal. He is one of the best snipers I've seen in my life, and he actually goes 45 and 0. He has a flawless game. He calls in, I think, around two pavlos, a bunch of reapers, and he, he really just brings it this game. Um, Raz actually came very close to getting a Moab as well, but he got a little impatient. Really, when you want to hunt for Moabs, you want to be patient. And uh, I, for the first time, I actually was patient this time around. It also helped that I didn't know what streak I was on. I was just killing people and I was like, I don't know what streak I'm on. Because after you hit your specialist bonus, you kind of lose track of the, the kills. So actually when I killed the guy and pick up the Moab, it's kind of it came as a surprise to me. And I actually started okay, jumping up and down and yelling, oh, I got I got And Raz is chuckling in the background. And um, so at this point... Jesse's close, and I said I'd, I'm going to bait for you, and I ended up just running around like an idiot and um, picking up some of the kills here. Um, but yeah, Sabotage is definitely one of the easiest game types to get a Moab. You get 20 minutes. If you have a team of three or four players, you can just hold the bomb. Uh, obviously, six would be ideal. You just hold the bomb, protect the bomb in a certain corner, and the other team is forced to rush you and come at you. And that way, if you entrench yourself in a good enough position, you can just pick them off and uh, as they come towards you. And at this point, time's running out. Jesse gets his Moab, calls it in, and we plant the bomb for the win. And then me and this guy get into a little bit of a gun battle. Sorry, Jesse, I kind of stole your kill here. But then I got sniped just as this guy was getting Moab, which is kind of impressive with his... Scar and thermal and heartbeat sense. Wow, that guy was really going for it. But uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the double Moab video. Um, be sure to drop by the new live stream. Live stream every day. This was actually caught on live stream. And hopefully, I can upload some more Moab videos and get you guys involved in some more open lobbies and stuff. I can see we won the game. That's another benefit of holding the bomb the whole time. You really just plant whenever you want to, and you win whenever you want to. And usually clans don't really play sabotage, so you end up playing a bunch of randoms. And um, so you can see the final score sheet here, and I'll catch you guys later.